Hi friends, this is Manish Pandey. Welcome back. I'm going to show you how to fix one of the issues that we are getting while logging into Blue Prism. Let me double click on this Blue Prism and I'm using 7.1.2. And you can see now we are getting this error message could not connect to SQL Server Windows authentication. That shows that you are running Blue Prism against an old version of the Blue Prism database. The database must be upgraded before it can be used with the current version of Blue Prism. Database version 444, this is the current version and the required version is 501. So let me show you how to fix this issue and how can we upgrade this version, this database version to 501. We click OK. So here we have two connections. If you'll we'll use this, you will able to log in that. But currently we are getting error for SQL Server Windows authentication. So select this, click on configure connection. We have this, select this one, we are getting this one, right? Now we have one button here, upgrade database. Click on that. You can see here, upgrade the database. The database will be upgraded to the required version. The upgrade cannot be undone. Please ensure you have backed up your database. Current database version is 444 and required database version is 501. Upgrade. So once you we'll click on upgrade, it will upgrade the version from 444 to 501. Now you can see here upgrade succeeded. Click on OK. Click on test connection so that we can see database valid or not. Yes, valid. Now click on OK. Now you can see we are not getting error with this SQL server. Let me click on this local DB and you can see we are not getting error. Here also we are not getting error. Let me log in into this. So you can see here now when I log into this one, it's asking to activate the blue prism. So from the previous video, you, re you remember like I already activated that, but I activated with other connection. So let me click on browse and let me find out that you know this license and click on next and you can see it's activated. Now all set. Okay. So I am able to log into this one now successfully without any error. I hope this video is useful for you. If so, Please like this video and please subscribe this channel. Thank you so much for watching this video.